Welcome! This tutorial will show you how you and your students can use Originality Reports, which are available in Assignments as well as Classroom. We'll start with how to enable Originality Reports, which you do when creating a new assignment. Log in to Assignments with your G Suite for Education account as usual. Click the Create button at the top of the screen and add details to your assignment, including the course name and due date. When you've filled out all of the needed information, click Run Originality Reports at the bottom of the form. This will let students scan their own work up to three times before turning it in and will automatically provide you with a report for each student file submitted for this assignment. Let's switch to a student account to take a quick look at how they can use Originality Reports. Once a student adds a file to the assignment, they can click Check Originality to run a report. It may take up to a minute to process as it's searching for matches across the entire web. If the report found web matches, the student can then open the report to explore further. They can then edit the assignment to make any needed revisions or add citations. Once finished, the student then submits the assignment for grading. Now we'll take a look at how the instructor can use Originality Reports. When you open a submission, you'll see the file name listed in the right panel. If the report found any passages that match copy found online, the number of flagged passages will be listed under the file name. Click on the notification to see the report. The flagged passages in the document are highlighted in gray. You can view the flagged passages as a number or as a percentage. This is the default number view. Click the pie icon to switch to the percentage view. Click the flag icon to switch back to the default number view. To examine flagged passages, click the highlighted text to display the student's passage right above the web match in the right column. Click the link under the web match to go directly to the online source for further exploration. Please note that Originality Reports only surface matches between student copy and existing web content. It's up to you to determine if intentional plagiarism has occurred. We hope you found this tutorial helpful. Remember, you can always find additional support in the Help Center, which you can access at support.google.com slash edu slash assignments.